Alright everybody, so we are out here in Birmingham, Alabama and <clears throat> I was lucky enough to get a parking spot at this Flying J Pilot. Only reason why I decided to see if there was parking here is because I don't want to run a full clock. I'm working, I work off of my recap hours and if I just run 10 days or a full clock every day I'm gonna have to park now granted most likely I'm gonna end up having to park eventually anyways because of freight or scheduling or something with the load but right now how it is I have about seven hours and seven minutes on my 70 I'm gonna grab an hour back hour and a half at midnight and I used about eight hours and one minute of driving and 12 minutes of on duty that's not right but yeah 12 minutes of on duty because my clock is Arizona time so when I did a pre-trip this morning it was an hour it was still the 29th in Arizona but anyways um, <clears throat> Parking spot is not bad to get in here. It really isn't. But I pretty much have no power steering. So by not having power steering, I can't sit there and whip this steering wheel like everybody else can right now. So me, I have to do it as I'm moving. And if I don't have that much room to pull up, well, then I'm screwed. So... As you can see, that truck right there, sitting right there. Now, granted, he's okay, but if he wasn't there, I would have got in here a lot quicker and easier. So, yeah. 
But with that being said, um, probably get up tomorrow sometime in the morning. Not super early, but just got to figure it out. Um, I do got another load. Picks up the 31st. Delivers on the 31st, I believe. I don't know. I got to really look at it. But anyways, there's pretty much nothing today. As you can see, as you guys seen. So granted, I don't I normally don't stop at truck stops and this freaking truck stop is packed. Like it is packed. Drivers are just making parking spots right there behind the fuel island. Um, I normally don't stop at truck stops, but when it boils down to it, I was gonna drive another thirty to thirty to forty minutes down the road now I'm just going to choose an on-ramp or an off-ramp but I said if there's a parking spot that I'm able to get into I might as well get in it so that's what I did So, <clears throat> as you seen earlier, we made it to our delivery. I actually showed up there. I didn't even park and wait. I just went straight to the delivery to Tyson and checked in. And come to find out, they're like, all right, go park, check in. And the lady's like, all right, here's a trailer empty trailer go hook up to it and you're done i was like cool so i just did drop and hook and got trailer trailer washed out 
got to my pickup just to drop the trailer because it's supposed to be preloaded so if it's a preloaded trailer most likely you'll be able to drop your trailer sooner so anyways the ladies checked in the two ladies at the gate kind of freaking rude but dropped my trailer because apparently they're telling me my load is not supposed to be ready until 2200 tomorrow my information says 10 a.m. tomorrow so yeah but with that being said i'm sleeping right now but i'm not but with that being said thank you guys for watching let me know what you guys think click the subscribe and yeah